Says more than a smoky mirror. Says I make the real feel real. Says it was pretty cool, wasn't it? I suppose I could share one small secret with such a smart boy as yourself. Valentino couldn't be happier in a world he created himself. Go on, boy. That's right, people! Tess tried to use his magic to get rid of us! Boys, this is all a misunderstanding. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Next time, you won't be disappointed. The great town of Monte Macabro has a time-honored tradition. The Wait Latoani is someone who takes care of the people. Give me that! Hmm... Huh. The resemblance is uncanny, but that doesn't prove anything. Don, it would be my great honor if I could introduce you to my... Uh, running mate. Oh, I guess it would be my... Oh, it's me! I promise you greatness and prosperity, the likes you have never seen before! Yeah. Ah, so you do want magic, eh? I suppose I could do it just this once. And he does call himself the Smoking Mirror. The rat and egg is more like it. Didn't your grandmother ever teach you not to steal? Stay back! No! <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> Let me guess. You thought my powers came from a worthless trinket. Come on. I thought you two were smarter than that. Well, we're smart enough to know you made the fog so you can trap everyone in this town. Please, be my guest. You two are free to go. Really? This isn't a trick? Victor. Valentino. Mm. Nice to see you finally accept me as your Tlatuani. I'm fired, aren't I? You have circumvented the governing process of the council, destroyed property, disturbed the peace, and corrupted the children. <sighs> Sister Reina, step forward. Go! Nothing wrong with a little late night yoga. Turn your gaze up to the moon. <laughs> Not to worry, no one is listening to those little brats. But we will still need to keep a close eye on them. I trust you'll continue to do so. Don was super weird about who's on the phone when we came in. I bet it was Tez telling him to destroy the evidence. Yes. <laughs> so when he went to the back, he must have switched out the tapes.